just about every evening we spend at least half hour, 45 minutes, maybe longer sitting here enjoying the evening. It's a quaint front porch that fits in perfectly with this quaint small town. There you go, yeah. But recently, the Potts discovered a new addition to their yard that perfectly stands out. I was on my way home from work and one of the neighbors called and said, hey, there's, there's a toilet in your front yard. This brightly colored receptacle was left right in the middle of their front yard. As one by one, other toilets began popping up across town. Definitely an attention getter. Uh, when you drive down any street in Hope and you see a, a brightly painted toilet set in the front yard, you've got to think, huh. And inside the toilet, they found a letter that explained why the toilet was here and what it stood for. And I thought, how funny would it be if we traveled toilets and flushed away hunger and did something like that? And it just kind of took off. Whitney Budd is both the painter and the planter of these special latrines. The goal of all this, to raise $2,000 to pay off the lunch accounts of local students. They can pay $10 to take it away. They can pay $20 to send it to a friend or a family member or a neighbor. So far, four toilets have visited 45 different homes, raising more than $1,000. It's been good. It's been good to be out in the community and meet new people and, and everybody seems to be a good sport about it. <laughs> With this friendly game, the town of Hope wants to flush away hunger for good. Because like a toilet in your front yard, it's an issue no one can ignore. It gives, it gives the whole community a sense of pride that the whole community steps up and funds this program. In Hope, Brett Cast, CBS4 News.